Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to Stories Untold. This is something that I wanted to play a long time ago and never got around to. I'm not, I have literally no idea what this is. I've never seen any other YouTubers play it. I've never read anything or watched anything. I basically, I've read the Epic Steam page, uh, Steam page? Epic Game page. Cross over there. Uh, and it seems like it could be interesting even though I don't like it. The 80s very much because I'm a little bit younger than that. Uh, so we are going to give this a go. And there's your credits. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of worried that this is meant to be a horror game. But uh, I was going to set up a webcam. But uh, oh wow, this is old school. I got a tape deck. Oh god, I don't even know how these things work. Okay, so the House Abandoned Interactive Horror Adventure. Okay, you pull up to the driveway of the family's holiday home and park the car. It's dark, but it's as Id idyllic as you remember from all that time ago. You remember being told to look in the glove box before going in. Now, games like this normally have commands. I don't know if they're going to be written anywhere, but, uh, oh. Commonly used text input commands. Look at, go to, use, open, and read. So if I go open glove box, inside is a key and a handwritten note from dad. You take both. Can we look at note? The note is from your dad and reads, Hi son, hope you enjoy your break. You'll need to fire up the generator round back to get power and lights on. Also, found something in the attic for you. It's in your room. Enjoy. Hmm. Oh, this is, this is strange. I don't think I've played a game like this. Like, it's weird. It's a 3D game where I'm looking at an old school computer on a brand new computer playing old school games. It's very, very strange. Uh, okay, so if we... Let's leave one of the commands. Uh, go... How about go to front door? I'm sorry, I don't understand. Do we have to leave car? You open the car door and step out. The house is grand, sat perfectly amongst the trees. In front of you is the front door, and the yard stretches around to the side of the house. So, the notes say we have to go around the side of the house to turn on the generator. So, go to yard? As an English man, we don't call them yards, we call them gardens. The yard has been well maintained. You spend a lot of time here with your family on holiday trips. Good memories. Look at a yard. You see a generator on the back wall of the house. A generator. You are standing next to the generator. Turn on. Generator. You switch the generator on and it whirs to life. The house it's still dark. Uh, go to front door. You walk back around to the front of the house. The house is grand, sat perfectly amongst the trees. In front of you is the front door, and the yard stretches around to the side of the house. Uh, wait, can I just look at the front door? Look at front door. Whoop, do do do. So you find out how bad I am at typing, I also apologize if um, you can hear my keyboard, keyboard. We have, we have a key. Do you insert the key and turn. The door lock clicks open. Open door. You step inside the front door. You enter the house to the hallway. It's dark and you can't see anything. 
You feel a light switch next to the door, however. Turn. Oh, turn. Turn on light. You flip the switch and the lights come on. The hallway is now brightly lit. There is access to the kitchen and living room here, as well as a set of stairs going up. Can we go to kitchen? You walk into the kitchen. The kitchen is tidy and well kept. There is a door to its utility room, but otherwise it's just a kitchen. I'm just looking around. The utility room door is locked. I have no idea where the key could be. Oh, okay. Who has locked doors inside their houses? That's a bit strange. Is that an American thing? <laughs> uh, go to living room. You step inside the living room. A spacious and comfortable living room. We spent a lot of good time in here, playing board games with the family. Warm and inviting. Nothing here of interest. Okay. You go back out to the hallway. The hallway is now brightly lit. There is access to the kitchen, living room here, as well as a set of stairs going up. It's a very small house. Go upstairs. You walk upstairs to the landing. There is a bathroom, two bedrooms, yours and your sister's. Where's the parents' room? That not a bit strange? Okay, well, uh, look at pictures. Family photos and holiday snaps. Ah, happy family. Okay. Uh, go to sister's room first. Or oh, sister's room, bathroom. Let's go, let's go to the bathroom. Go to bathroom. You step inside the bathroom. You are in the bathroom. There's not much to note, but it's all in good order. Ooh, good. Love a good bathroom. <laughs> I'm on my room, there's a present in there, so let's check out the sister's bedroom first. Go to sister's bedroom. You walk into your sister's old room. Your sister's room is in perfect condition, untouched since the last time you had seen her. Posters of her heroes and some of her own attempts at art adorn the walls. A few shelves are crammed full of trophies. Her bed is drowned under a pile of colourful soft toys. A real nostalgia trip. Let me look at the toys. Every soft toy she has ever owned. <laughs> Apparently not. Okay then, to my bedroom. Man, did you people survive? These loading times are insane. Go to my bedroom. You walk into your old room. Your old bedroom. So many good memories in here. And it's been preserved so well. On the desk is a gift wrapped box. Look at box. A large gift wrapped presence. The tag says your name. Open box. You unwrap the gift excitedly. You can't believe it. Dad has found your old computer. A Futuro 128K plus two. It's been preserved well in the attic and hopefully still works. Is that not a Futuro 128K? It's not the plus two model though. It's getting weird, isn't it? Your old bedroom, so many good memories in here. It's been preserved so well. On your desk is a Futuro 128K plus 2 computer and a copy of the house abandoned. It's all still to be set up though. Okay, can I look? Now, do I have to type out that whole thing or can I just type in Futuro? <clears throat> house abandoned. A standard bedroom, a desk, a wood grain TV, clock, the usual. How do I set it up? Can I just type in set up? No. What commands do we have to work with here? Look at go to use open read. Use. I'm just going to have to type in the whole thing. I'm just going to do it. 
Turo 128k. It's two. Okay. Can I just type in use computer? Start to plug in the various cables and leads. Why did I not think to type in computer? The computer is all set up and ready to go. There's a game here too. Uh, Use game. You put in, you put the cassette in the computer and press play. Whoa, shh, Christ. My uh, <laughs> phones were very loud. Oh no. Ah. Get out, get out, get out. Oh, that, that really made me jump. I should have set up the webcam. You pull up the driveway of the family holiday home and park the car. It's dark, but it's clearly neglected. I remember being told to check the glove box before going in. You can't stand to be near this place. Open glove box. Inside is a key and a handwritten note from Dad. You take both. Oh, oh man. My heart is going ten to a dozen right now. That was perfect. You don't recognise the handwriting. It says get out, 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 get out the car. Get out, get out. Uh, get out, car. You force the. Wait, what? You force the warped. Oh dear, the yard is to the side. The wood creaks in the wind, and all happy memories are gone from this place. There is no love here. Is the generator still here? Can I go to yard still? You step through the debris to the backyard. The grass is overgrown, and weeds crawl up the side of the house. It's not a nice place to be. You clutch the note, needing to look around. Look at the yard. There is an old generator next to you. Can I look at generator? I have a feeling it's not going to work. The old generator can supply power to the house. Okay, turn. On a generator. There isn't much fuel, but the generator starts up. Look at the, look at the pictures. Oh man. Ah, this is making me feel uncomfortable. Oh man. I'm, I just. Now I know this jump scares, I'm freaking out. Because I am bad. The lights just went out. Oh no, we're good. The house looks abandoned, there is a yard to the side. Wood creaks in the wind, and all happy memories are gone from this place. There is no love here. I'm sorry I don't understand. Sorry. Uh, open door. The door appears to be locked. You will need to use the key. Sorry, use key. You unlock the door. The click of the lock hurts to hear. Oh man, you reluctantly step in. Pitch black, but your senses are punished more by the smell. Stale air and damp. This could not be less inviting. The note burns in your hands and you feel compelled to read it over and over. Too dark to read, but it feels weird to the touch. Can we turn on light? Afraid of what you might see, you flick the light switch. The lights flicker on and off. The walls are falling apart. After years of neglect or worse, there are stains. Oh, good God. Upstairs, the sound of an alarm clock blaring. Someone else is in the house. That can't be. Ah. Uh, uh, turn off alarm. Make it stop, make it stop, make it stop, make it stop. Yes, make it stop. Please, stop. Oh. 
Okay, yeah, I can feel the panic setting in. Bloody hell. You're still in the hallway. The noise has stopped, but you feel a presence. Someone is in the house. They should not be here. There is a kitchen and a living room. Adjacent and the stairs leading up. The note feels disgusting in your hand. Can I read the note again? Oh, man. Can't read the note. It's bleeding. Oh, God. Have I ever mentioned... I know, this might be a thing. I despise horror games. I don't even know why I'm doing this. I didn't realise it was going to be quite... So... Terrifying. Uh, I should not have worn my headphones. Go to kitchen. I can't spell. Ah, oh, go to. I'm falling apart. Honestly. Go into the kitchen. Kitchen stinks and feels completely unfamiliar. The tabletops are rusted metal. There is a carcass on the table. There is writing on the wall, and the utility room door has a red X painted on it. Uh. The door is locked. I can't get in there. Not yet. Mm, okay. Excuse me while I just turn the volume down on my headset, because I had it so loud. Those ambient noises actually scared the crap out of me. I've just noticed that the alarm clock's gone to 9999. Uh, go to living room, go to living room. I like the first game better. That was nice and... Although hardly an appropriate term, the furniture is threadbare and worn. The note is fixed in your mind. Red fills the pit of your stomach. This is not a nice place. I read the note now. The note, always changing, now reads. Get through this. I don't care if you want to or not. Oh. <laughs> is that, was that the uh, was that the developer? Let me just stop being a bit of a bit of a bad man. Okay, leave. I don't want to go upstairs, dude. There's a man in my bedroom. It's me. I'm sitting here. It's me. He's gonna come behind me, and it's gonna make me jump. Ah, someone is in the house. They should not be here. Go upstairs. Oh, wait. You head up the stairs. They creak and I can hear someone behind me. The landing has access to your sister's room, your room and the bathroom. Oh. Yeah, he can't understand either. You hear him answer the phone. Your mind hurts, and you taste iron. Voices spill out of the phone into the room. Whoever is in there should not be there. You need to hang up the phone. I do, whoever. Consider the worst. You consider the worst. Oh. Same but different. <laughs> should have carried on listening to the phone call, shouldn't I? The pictures are of your family. The eyes have been scored out of out on all. I apologize. My ability to read is somewhat impaired when I am crapping myself. Oh dear. <clears throat> okay, go to sister. No, go to bathroom. Bathroom. You enter the bathroom. You can hear doors opening. The bathroom feels disgusting. Every surface is covered in a layer of oily grime. The sink is a haven for all kind of bugs. Look at bugs. Sorry, I don't know what you're doing. Okay, yeah, fine. You step back onto the landing. My sister's twice. Jennifer's room is boarded up. I'll bear this. Jennifer. I didn't know her name. Oh well, go to my room. Ha ha ha! The door is bolted shut with a four digit combination lock. Oh. Sorry, I don't know what you're looking at. The lock. Look at. Um. 
Destination Lock. Door is bolted shut with a four digit combination lock. Unlock door. And grab the lock. Lock is rusted, not used in years. The key in your hands weighs heavy, the note heavier. You grab the lock and you can now input the code. Okay, so I have to find out what the code is? The note is reacting. Get in the door, get in the door. Get in the room, get in, do it, go. I assume the four digit lock, the combination lock is going to be inside of this room somewhere. Not going to be 1282, is it? No. You know it's in this house somewhere. Okay, why is the key? Look at the key. I hate this key. I should never have come back here. <laughs> okay. You let go of the lock. Same but different. Landing has access to your sister's room, your room, and the bathroom. I assume that's Jennifer. The fact that I can look around this room makes me think. Two sisters' room. Jennifer's room is boarded up. I'll bear this. Uh, unboard? No, I don't, uh, we haven't got like crowbar or anything, so I don't think that's going to be a thing. Uh, where? I wonder if I can read read the note. Oh. No, it's clear saying, get in, get out. Can we just leave? I don't think that, that's not going to be the right thing, is it? Okay, go down. Down still. I've been to every room. What am I missing? The flashing light is making me feel very uncomfortable. Uh, go to my room. Door is bolted shut. Uh, knock on door. <laughs> Let's go. Let's see if it was going to be coded into the game. That's all. Uh, open door. Bolted shut with a four-digit combination lock. Lock is in the house somewhere. The note just says, note is reacting, get in the door, get in the door, get in, do it, go. I suppose I can just smash it. Rusted lock, somehow I doubt it. I swear I've looked all over the room, okay. Go over the lock. Let's go downstairs. We'll have a quick look around. I am running out of time, but. Ugh. Oh, freaking me out. Uh. Pictures are of your family. The eyes have been scored out of them all. Uh. Something's different about them is throwing me, but okay. Go down. Stairs. You go back downstairs. We're still in the hall hallway. The noise has stopped, but you feel a presence. Someone is in the house. They should not be here. There is a kitchen and a living room. Can we go to the kitchen? Go into the kitchen. The kitchen stinks and feels completely unfamiliar. The tabletops are rusted metal. There is a carcass on the table.
Look at Carcass. He looked closer, but can't tell what it is. What it was. Oh! Ah! <laughs> God, that made me jump. Oh, 1986. There it is, right there, right in front of me. Oh, my God. Okay. Leave. Step back to the hallway. Your shoes are wet. You're still in the hallway. The noise has stopped, but you feel a presence. Someone is in the house. I have never felt so uncomfortable while playing a video game. This is horrible. It's just text. It's just text, and I'm just reading it. Lighting effects. Lighting effects are making me jump. <laughs> Can we read the note? Can't read the note. It's bleeding. Okay. Uh, go up stairs. You head up the stairs. That's creek. Ah, this is bad. <sighs> Grab the lock. The lock is rusted. Not used in years. The key is in your hands. Weighs heavy. The note heavier. You grab the lock. You can now input the code. Nineteen eighty-six. The lock clicks open, and it's to my left. Ah. Ah. Not liking this at all. I do. Ah, oh dear. Hi. Hello. Why is it red? Oh, God. Oh, come on. Ah, go to my room. I don't want to look. I'm sorry, Jennifer. I'm sorry, Mum. I'm sorry, Dad. You haunt every step I take, even in this place. I was It was out of my hands, but still you punish me. I can be with you now. There's nothing left to do. I'm consumed and confused. This has to end now. You're pathetic. It was all your fault. Say it. No! Oh, please stop. No! It was all my fault. Say it. No! Just say it. No! <laughs> Just say it. Ah, uh, hit. Ah. Uh. Ah, there we go. I know. I'm sorry. I know. I'm resistant. Oh, Christ. That was absolutely brilliant. I have never felt quite so uneasy simply staring at a tape deck. <laughs> I guess I will let the credits roll for the first episode. There are four episodes apparently, but for this video, I will literally just do the first. I think it's going to get more obscure and harder the further we go in. That was very, very enjoyable. So either way, thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe. Your comments are greatly appreciated. And as always, I'll see you next time.